Thank you for joining this lesson. We're going to study transformations and matrices. And for this matter, we're going to consider KCC 2011 paper, whereby we had a question saying that the vertices of a rectangle are as given. Then we are told that on the grid provided, draw the rectangle and its image A, B, C, D prime. And a transformation of matrix is given here. So we know very well for us to get image, then we multiply a matrix and object for us to get image. Therefore, when we get the column, okay, the matrix first of all, then we multiply these with the column vectors of the coordinates, negative 1, negative 1, then we have negative 4, negative 1, negative 4, negative 3, and finally negative 1, negative 3, so when we multiply this vector, the, 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 the matrix and the vector columns, you're going to get negative 2 by 1, which is 2, because it's negative and negative, 0 by this, so we'll get positive 2. Then here we will have 8 and 0, so positive 8. The next two will have 8 and 0, so 8 again. Then finally we will have 2 positive and 0, so 2 positive. Then on the other side, we shall have 0 by negative 1 and negative 2 by 1, which becomes 2. Then we have 0 by 4 and negative 2 by 1, we get negative 2. 0 by 4 and negative 2 by 3, making it negative 6. Then finally, 0 by negative 1 and negative 2 by negative 3, making it negative positive 6, sorry. Then this one is positive because it's negative 2 by negative 3. So these are the coordinates of the image. A prime will be 2, 2. B prime will be 8. Okay, here we should have add 0 by negative 4 and 0 by 2, which makes it positive. So this one is also positive. So 8 by 2. Then C will be 8 by 6. Then finally D prime will be 2 by 6. So we are taught to plot this one. And plotting this one on the same axis. On the same axis. So we shall have negative 1, negative 1, this is A, negative 4, negative 1, negative 4, negative 1, this is B, then we have negative 4, negative 3, this is C, and we finally have negative 1, negative 3, negative 1, negative 3, this is D, so this is the rectangle. This is how the rectangle looks like. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and please share this link. After drawing the rectangle like that, we can now get to its image. Thereby we are saying we have 2, 2. This is our A. B is 8, 2. This is where B is. Then 8, 6. 8, 6. We have our C there. And 2, 6. We have our D here. So this is the image rectangle. This is the image after that translation. The triangle comes, the rectangle comes here. That is the rectangle. So now we are told further in the question that ABCD double prime is the image of ABCD prime and a transformation with matrix P given there, determine the coordinates of 
the double prime. So because we have already the single prime here, we can multiply it, the matrix P, which is half, one, one half, and we multiply it with two, two, eight, two, eight, six, and two, six, so that we get the new image. So the new image will be half, half by two, which is one, plus two, which is three. Then we have half by eight, which is four, plus two, which is six, half by eight, which is four, plus six, which is 10, half by two, which is one, plus one by six, which is six, so we get seven there. Then on the other side, we will have one by two, which is two, plus half, which is three, because half by one is one. Then one by eight is one, and one by two is one. So that will be eight plus one, which is nine. This will be eight, and half, half by six is three. Half by six is three. So we'll have eight and three, 11. Then one by two, which is one, and half by six, which is three. So one plus three be four. So the coordinates will have double prime, three, three, B double prime, six, nine, C double prime, 10, 11, and finally D double prime, seven, four. So those are the coordinates of the new image. On the same grid, we are told to draw, then find its area. So we're trying to draw, we're trying to draw this grid on the same grid, trying to draw the second image, the second image on the same grid. So this means because we can see values of X, <coughs> values of Y going up to positive 11, we need to, we need to extend these axes and have 9, 10, 11, like that. Then we plot 3, 3, 3, 3. This is a double prime, so single prime. Then the other coordinate is 6, 9, 6, 9. This is where we will have our B, double prime. Then 10, 11, 10, 11. C is going to be there, and D we have seven four, seven four here. So we love our D double prime. So the new rectangle is going to appear like this. This is how it is going to appear. Make sure you are following Kinley, subscribe to our channel and share the link. So that's how we multiply matrices to get images. Thank you for following, subscribe to Shifting Grades and share the link.